Hey there everybody, Arlo's here from Ice Games, bringing you episode 51 of my Guild Wars 2 Ranger Let's Play with Kivina here. What do we have planned this episode? Well, as you can tell, we are not quite where we ended last time. We are all the way up in the Norma, or we were at the Norma Waypoint, but now we're all the way up here. Uh, mainly because I was trying to figure out where this vista was, and uh, there's some nice water here. Because as you can tell, if I jump into the water here... My companion turns into, where'd you go? <gasps> My little shark. Uh, I'm still so happy to have this shark. This is this might actually get me to do a little bit more underwater combat. So I got uh, Pristis here. So um, Zabrina, you, uh, hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, but you gave me some name ideas for my shark, and you said that uh, Pristis, it's, lat it's shark for Latin, or Latin for shark, wait, Latin for shark, not shark for Latin. Uh, I don't know, I don't know what the, the shark uh, word for Latin would be, but uh, maybe someday we'll figure that out. Um, but uh, I like that idea, you gave me a couple other ideas, um, but I really liked, I really liked this one. I thought it was kind of neat. Gertrude was was kind of on my list, but I might save Gertrude for a different animal. Uh, but thank you so much for Sabrina for sending me some uh, some awesome awesome shark names. I like that. Uh, is there any other my pets that I need? I don't think any of my other pets need names. I like how my the uh, the, the 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 river Drake here. It just looks like it's there. He goes. Looks like he was just standing there still. All right, let's swap back to the shark. Uh, and I was gonna say, uh, a funnic gamer, you gave me some really cool ideas for. Um, different ways I could, uh, you know, do combat. I do kind of, if you guys notice, I get a little stale sometimes. But uh, you were letting me know. Oh, apparently I hit the, the roll button to jump back into combat. Didn't want to do that. So you were saying how uh, you use the longbow and greatsword. So you'll start the longbow with doing, like, the barrage attack. And then you'll switch it up to uh, two or rapid fire, which gives vulnerability. Then you'll switch to the greatsword, jump at them with swoop, and then use maul to get and get more vulnerability as soon as it's available. So I think I might might give that a try. It sounds like something kind of fun. Actually, you know what? We got a bear here. Let's give it a try on this bear. So um, uh, let's barrage with five. Whoop! Vulnerability there. Rapid fire, and then switch, and then oh, three to jump at them. Oh, killed it too soon. But I, I kind of get the idea, the rotation idea. So it's getting vulnerability um, on the enemy. Uh, something, if you guys noticed, uh, I've been doing a little bit more with my uh, Necromancer also, which uh, I'm learning that vulnerability is actually pretty amazing. So uh, without further ado, though, we should head up to this. Oh, so, uh, well, sorry. Yeah, thank you, Afana Gamer, for, for letting me know about that so much. Also, uh, some stuff about the, what is it, with the training. You were mentioning how the Marksman has, um, it's really good for like, the longbow. And the last one, Lend the Wind. Well, wielding the longbow, your attack speed is increased and your arrows pierce, which is super awesome. And the, the uh, longbow and harpoon gun skills recharge faster. That's actually awesome, too. So that might be something I'll definitely be striving for. But this fist up here, it took me way too long to figure out how to get here. Um, an embarrassing amount of time. Uh, but what you do is by this lake here, climb up here where these bears were. And you just hop up here. Nice and simple. And then from here, what is it? You hop up on this, I believe I was doing. Yeah, I believe. Right here. You can hop up here. Whoop. Zoom in a little bit so you can kind of see where I am. And then across the snow, I got stuck in a bush. Across the snow, snow peak here. That's what I did last time. There we go. And on the snow peak here, then you get to where the vista is. So let's go take. Apparently, my my little uh, my blue moa is just uh, just hopping into place with me. That's kind of fun. <laughs> Not walking, just just teleporting. Um, so let's view this awesome vista. And again, I want to thank you guys so much for all the tips, strategies, hints you guys get, all the likes, all the, the comments. You guys are simply amazing. These beautiful, beautiful vistas. So keep them coming. If you guys do have any ideas, any suggestions, just let me know down below. If I'm doing something that, you know, like, ah, that's the worst thing ever, uh, let me know. I've had a couple comments in my other videos telling me I need to stop. Hey, someone else is here doing some awesome stuff. Um, telling me I click my... Uh, things too much. It's something I'm going to be working on. I think after I'm recording this video, uh, possibly I'm going to work on kind of changing my key binding. So if you guys have any suggestions for that, let me know. Because I am pretty pretty bad at just clicking my skills. Uh, <laughs> something I've been, I don't know, something I've done for my entirety of playing video games on PC. I don't know. It's just something I do. So I'm sorry, guys. I should work on that. 
I need to work on it. But what are we going to do now? So I got this Vista. What do I have left right now? Hmm. I've got one task here. I've got two hero challenges. So one here. Where's another hero challenge? I got that one. Oh, no, there's another hero challenge. Another couple waypoints. I got one, two, and there should be a third one here, probably. Maybe it's over here. Got all the vistas. Points of interest. Two more points of interest. So, yeah, we're pretty much pretty much finished with this area. I just got to kind of head down this area. So that's the plan this episode. Uh, we're going to head over there now. Yes, yes, let's head over there now. Um, yep. Yes. Head down here. And head across the water. Where is... You're going to head across the water to here. Kind of going here, avoiding the uh, the the crate witch that clearly I cannot fight, guys. Uh, on my own, at least. Which is, uh, you know, it makes sense. It's a group event, so it makes sense I could do it on my own. But hey, if you guys ever want to do some, like, you run around and do some group events with me... Um, anything like that, that would be awesome. Let me know if you guys are down for uh, playing some Guild Wars 2 with me. I've also had some uh, someone was commenting, wondering if I was going to do like a guild or something like that. I've been thinking about it. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, if you guys want me to start uh, our own kind of like uh, kind of guild that we can play. In. I know in Guild Wars 2 you can, you can be in five different guilds. So if that's something you guys are interested in, let me know. I might, I might just start it just, just because. Um, even if no one else joins, I'll, I'll, I'll be happy to have my own little guild. But, uh, ooh, juvenile polar bear? What? No. Oh, no, it's your polar bear. That's okay, I guess. I was about to try to steal your polar bear. Now I want a polar bear. Um, anyways. <laughs> oh, man, collecting pets is half the fun of being a ranger, I've noticed. All right, so let's talk with Commander uh, Sleepu. Sleepdu. Sleptu. Sleedu. Uh, so... <laughs> Uh, uh, Qigans need your help. Uh, scout slip in deeps, rescue prisoners, recover supplies, or just kill Qigans enemies. So how should I go about uh, scouting slip dune deeps? Uh, Qigans can cloak you if you look like, if you look for crate weaknesses, weaknesses straight, clear of crate witch, she can make you visible again. Uh, make me unseen and I'll scout the deeps with you. Oh, oh, makes me invisible. What? That's cool. Uh, what can I also do, though? Uh, why are the crate taken prisoners? Crate sacrifice Coogan to, and Hylek to summon big bad fish. Please save Coogan and Hylek to, to, to ooh. Um, what else we got going on? Uh, what sort of supplies should I be looking for? Uh, crate steals shiny things from Coogan's. Coogan needs shiny things back to trade for food and weapons. And... The caves here. So the caves are dangerous. Coogan who swim into caves never return. Cave scary. Do not enter. Uh, okay. Good to know, good to know. Is someone fighting the witch right now? If that witch, like, health starts to go down, I might kind of go down and help help out there. Okay, now, collect Hugan treasure, defeat crate. Oh, apparently there's a shark down here, too, a giant shark. I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to be doing down here. I'm invisible, so it's okay. Looking for things, stuff and things. Well, I got some platinum ore over there. Barracuda, fresh order cab. Collect Quigan treasures, defeat crate, and free crate prisoners. Okay, is there a prisoner here? Do they not see me? Oh, there's a treasure. There we go. Oh, oh, we got a prisoner cage. That's, uh, what's that? <laughs> Apparently they just have one skill and it's a swim with the grace of them. Okay. Help someone out. Go, my minion, go. Attack the crit cage. <laughs> oh, also... Uh, a funny gamer, you let me know that um, my the healing abilities I was using were not very good. Apparently, 
apparently sun or uh, um the water spirit is the worst healing apparently so let's switch that up underwater you're saying we heal as one's pretty good so let's switch that um you know what let's just drop that i'm fine with not being invisible right now all right what am i gonna switch to those two in a second oh let's grab the treasure What? Oh, oh, I'm invisible when I have the trick. Am I just invisible in general? Oh, 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 when I pick up the treasure that I, I don't have any other abilities to use. That makes sense. Can you attack this thing for me? Attack my target. There we go. Okay, so I'm still invisible. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's what that, that's how that works. All right, well, let's keep taking out the crate cages. Someone else here helping out, taking out the cages. Which is awesome. So... Are you gonna, are you gonna help me here, buddy? There we go. <laughs> there we go. Gotta keep attacking it, apparently. Let's help you with this one. There we go. I'm gonna grab uh, this Kugan treasure. And interact with it. So gather up the treasure. Excellent. Now let's head back to where I'm supposed to be. To drop it off. Let's see how much that adds. Now what does that do? Oh, it gives me swiftness. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Alright. And I was going to see what abilities I can switch these to. Huh. Let's see here. It's that one for movement, speed... Um, sure, let's get some quickness there, too. We can swim faster underwater. Um, what's that? Survive bleeding foes. Oh, bleed flows on your next few attacks. That's actually pretty pretty good, too. And, um, strength of the pack grains might to your pet when you attack. That's not bad. Let's do that. Switch up our abilities a little bit there. Okay, let's talk. Drop off this treasure here. Whoop. Oh, oh, like, like it increases by quite a bit, which is awesome. It's a shark down here. Is that where the shark is? I just want to take a look. Oh my gosh, look at that thing. I got a shark too. Let's do this. Rah, take out their shark with my shark. Oh, it's because it can't see me. That's what's going on. Heal up. Do bleeding and all that fun stuff. Come on. Take this guy down. Oh, it's the same <laughs> It's the same item anyways. Okay. Actually, which is a stronger one then? Um, you are 234. You're 427. Which one I have equipped now? I don't even know which one I have equipped right now. Okay, I clearly can't take out this great shark alone. So let's head out. Um, oh, you're under avoid combat. Okay, we should guard. Turn to me. Let's head back down. That's why you probably weren't attacking. I want to make sure I got the right one equipped here. Oh, still in combat technically. There we go. You're okay. Stay with me. You know what? Let's use the bad. Yeah, you're not let's unequip that one. Make sure I only have one equipped. To the same item, so that way I I, uh, I make sure I have the the right one equipped. Oh, let's actually take out some of you guys here. Come on, come on, come on! Do our feeding frenzy. Come on! Ooh, grab some loot too. <laughs> Am I even hitting it? Okay, I am. Okay, good. Frayed regs. Mm. Oh, we got some more Kugans in here trapped. Let's uh, help rescue you guys. Attack my target. So one thing is, um, like, cages and doors and stuff seem extra tough in this game. <laughs> Which, I mean, isn't so bad, but, uh, you know, sometimes I wish they were a little bit easier to take down. Oh, oh, you got that one. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Let's uh, see if we can help some more of you guys out. 
Oh, oh, I'm visible now. Let's help you out. If more of us do this, it'll be easier, right? What's this here? Let's see what that is. There's a man of war. Oh, it sends a jellyfish. That's cool. What is this? Commune. Dark energy of the crate appear to be concentrated here. Let's leave it alone for now, then. Tell me to leave it alone, so I'll leave it alone. Oh. Come on, Pristus. Let's do this. Let's take out this crate cage. Should be able to finish this one nice and simple like. Oh, are you? What's up with you, buddy? Are you okay? You can leave now. You don't have to be trapped in here anymore. Throw it out there. You can you can do whatever you want. You're free now. Free go. <laughs> or you know, take a nap. If that's what you want. <laughs> Summoner jellyfish. Oh, counter strike. Those counter strike's not gonna work against the cage. And I think after I take out this cage, if I take a crate uh, treasure or a Cuban treasure, should be enough for me to uh, finish this mission here. So let's grab this, gather it up. Do some swimming. There we go. Definitely be enough now. So let's do that. Let's um, yeah, let's get quickness too. So go even quicker. All of the quickness. All of the quick travel. I like that. <laughs> like my, my little uh, blue moa underwater. Silly blue moa. All right, let's give this to you. We are done. What do you say here? So, uh, dearest Kivina, it is with great pleasure that Krugan writes you, you and Krugan's favor, you you are Krugan's favorite now because you were so good at, to keep the crate away. You inspired Krugan's one day. Krugan's will throw the crate out of Norma Lake and Krugan's will have their, have a free and safe home. Uh, love, Commander Sleedoop. Let's accept that. And do you have anything for sale? Well, first off, let's sell any junk I have. Oh, oh, a friendship shell. Um, no, I kind of want to keep what I have already. Commander's ring. Power, healing power. No, I want to keep uh, precision and condition damage. That is pretty good. Um, that is much better than I currently have, so let's grab that. Let us equip it then. Equip. And inventory for a second. Can I get rid of any of this stuff? No, I want to keep that. Do can't get rid of that, so I'm gonna put you down here. Quagen hates crate. All crate must die. Hazardal materials. Who hate crate? Hate the crate are evil. Then kill them all. <laughs> you on crate. Be careful, okay? Oh, those guys are awesome. Well, let's grab this waypoint here. Um, where are we? There we go. Waypoint here. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Head. Is there. Maybe I can. In this cave system, there's something. Oh, there is a cave. Okay. Let's see if there's anything in here. Tale of the Serpent discovered. Oh, okay. There's, um. Champion Cave Troll in here. What's this? What's this? Portobello mushrooms. Let's grab the mushrooms. Need the mushrooms. Where is... Where's the... The cave troll? Is it, like, above me or somehow? Oh, yeah, it is above me. Okay. Well, let's gather that anyways. All right. And then let's head out of here. Apparently there's a fight in here or something like that. Okay, so how would I get to that cave troll? Can I go up here? The green moa here. Where does this take me? Ooh. Oh, this is like a whole little uh, cave system here. That's kind of cool. Turn that button for a second. Oh, excellent. Where's my, where's my, oh, the, like, where's my leopard? Where's my snow leopard? Okay, barrage. Rapid fire. Um, charge at them. Vulnerability. Okay. 
There we go. There we go. Yeah, that works pretty good. I like that. Anything in the water here? No, it doesn't look like it. Let's switch back to this for a second. Take down the spider, because I can. Another cave troll, so let's rapid fire. And then swoop at you and cause vulnerability. Oh my gosh, you did that so quick with vulnerability. I love it. Love it. Love Maul even more now. And I knew Maul was awesome, but this makes it just so much better. Gotta get out of the way though. <laughs> Too distracted by um, my key combinations that I'm not uh, paying attention to the red circle that's around me. Some healing there. There we go. Got some items there. Keep heading around here. Got another cave troll here. Does that add anything at all? Okay. There we go. Take you out. Take you out. A lot of bonus experience for taking you guys out, which is nice. Whoop. Let's dive back in. Dive on in. <laughs> uh, I've been watching too much American Dad lately. Uh, <laughs> All right. Take you out. Excellent, excellent. And that's, again, just a little cave system there. Which you totally could miss. I mean, not that I suggest missing it, but it looks like you totally could miss this whole area. Oh. Is there like a pool or something there? Oh man. Let's switch to my longbow for a second. There we go. Whoop, apparently you uh summoned right away. Oh my gosh, I'm getting really bad at missing the attack. I'm sorry guys. I should be doing better judging. There we go. Ooh, a new longbow. A new short bar, sorry. Where does this go? Let's just, just... Oh, no, it goes into water. Where are we? Oh my gosh, it's a whole thing of barracudas. Oh gosh, oh gosh. <laughs> Did not expect that. Did not expect to be under attack by a whole gang of uh, school of barracudas? Would you still call it a school of barracudas? Anything cool under here, maybe? I don't know. Are my sharks stuck in the rock here? Got the loot here. Oh, okay. Done and done, it looks like. Oh, cool. That's a whole, like, cave here. A whole underwater cave. Oh my gosh, there's so, so many awesome little things inside the Guild Wars, too. Like, oh, look at this. Oh man, this is so cool. Oh, is this how I get to this area here? Too far away for that. Frenzy. Get some bleed on here. Take you down if I can. Uh, well, yeah, add some vulnerability to you. Quickness. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think that this feels like this might be actually how I get. Oh, because it's underwater. I get it. Oh, it's a crate city that's underwater. Oh, cool. Not a crate, um, a, a Kugan city that's underwater. That's under attack by the crate. Oh, that all makes sense now. I thought it was like a cave, like a, like a cave system or like under a mountain or something. I mean, technically it looks like it is under a mountain, but so awesome. Oh, oh, need to heal, need to heal. Uh, not doing so good right now, guys. Come on, health go up, health go up. Six seconds, five. And I can do my healing. Oh my gosh, I almost died there without even paying attention to what's going on. I was just too amazed at what's, what everything I see here. Oh, apparently it's an event going on. That's what's going, that's what's, that's what's, that's what's happening. Oh, apparently I'm being attacked. 
healing. Only 15 seconds for the heal, so that's good. Go. And you get regen on it too, which is nice. Come on. There we go. What does this one do again? Quickness, feeding frenzy, um, and bleeding. Oh, apparently I'm attacking the Barracuda. <laughs> Try to save. Can I just save you guys? How do I? How do I? How do I protect you guys? I'm surviving you. Ooh, I leveled up. Awesome. I like leveling up. <laughs> Fighting the Barracuda. Let's do some healing here. That feels my pet too, which is nice. Come on, guys. Or do I just have to... Is it one of those where I just have to take out as much uh, crate as I can before enough you can get captured? Is that kind of the idea for this one? Go, use a jellyfish. Yeah, kind of like an underwater combat a little bit more now that I have a shark. Let's grab those items. Not in combat right now. Can I heal? Can I free you now? No. Oh, 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 what was that? What was that? Something hit me. Oh, that was you guys. All right, so let's swim up to them. What's that? Do some healing. Quickness, let's do some bleeding and strength of the pack. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Going down really quick, going down really quick. Come on, regen, help me, help me here. Oh, oh, healing, healing, healing. Come on, let's take you down. Come on, the crate are not doing so well. Some more healing here. Let me get over here so we can uh, get some help if I'm in combat. Um, and I have to go up to grab. There we go. And we got that point of interest. Swim at you. F2 ability. I gotta stop. Okay, no more clicking. I'm just gonna move my mouse over here. Can't, can't. My mouse is away. <laughs> okay, I gotta I got at least aim with my mouse. Three, swim up to you. Use my abilities here. Do some healing with six. There we go. Come on, come on. I'm trying to finish this objective here. Where are they all at? So are you? Okay, you're gone. Grab some items. Um, which way? Which way? This way? There you are. There's one over here. But you might not be part of the event, so let's... Never... It's like, oh, okay, they're going this way. Okay. It's got the... Uh, it's got the... Uh, Sword symbols here to show you where you need to go, which is nice. There we go. There we go. <laughs> All my abilities. There we go. Got to be almost done this. Close to being done. From the east now. Okay, coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. There we go. This should be enough to finish this, hopefully. Come on, 
Let's get in here, guys. Right, my shark's ability takes forever to recharge. Leads event successful. Awesome. Let's make sure experience with that. Um, I'm also going to use or do this to see if I level up. So um, I get to the personal story chapter six. Uh, dungeon story, Sorrows Embrace, World vs. World. So, storm castles and conquer territories in World vs. World, enter the mist through eternal battlegrounds, surrogates in major cities, or by clicking the castle icon here. So that'll go some World vs. World. If you guys want to see some World vs. World, let me know what you guys think. I, I haven't really done much of it at all. I think you can actually tell from my rank and ability, my rank of one. That's how much I've done, that that little amount. Uh, let me know what you guys are thinking. If you guys want to see some PV some uh, World vs. World or some PvP, or hey, if you guys want to do some World vs. World PvP too, let me know down below. Uh, we've unlocked our personal story. Let's accept that. Close that off. And I think, I think that's going to be that for this episode, guys. I'm just going to kind of hang out in this little hut here. That's what I need to do for the end of the episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like what you see, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. If you don't like what you see, you can hit the dislike button too. Hopefully you guys are enjoying what's going on because I'm having a lot of fun making the content. I hope you guys have fun watching it. And if you guys want to join me or if you have any tips or anything like that, let me know down below. And until next time, guys, keep your stick on the ice.